I'm Ranger Day with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers at Proctor Lake. At the lake, the Proctor staff want to make sure that everyone is safe. So anytime that you're around water, it's always a good idea to wear your life jacket. There are five types of personal flotation devices, or PFDs, that are Coast Guard approved. But which one is right for you? All Coast Guard approved PFDs are approved to save your life in an emergency. But each one is also ranked for different activity types and different situations. Let's have a look. A type 1 PFD is for offshore activities such as deep sea fishing, cruises, or stormy conditions. If you fall off a boat and become unconscious, this PFD is more than likely going to turn you over and keep your head out of the water. In rough waters, this is extremely important for your survival. If you're going out into the ocean, then a type 1 PFD is for you. A type 2 PFD is for inland waters such as lakes, rivers, streams, ponds, and tanks where you're more likely to be noticed and rescued quickly if you were to fall out of a vessel. This type of life jacket will keep you afloat and this headpiece in the back will help you roll over if you're unconscious, although that's not guaranteed. A type 3 life jacket is also for inland waters where immediate rescue is very likely. This life jacket can be used for activities such as kayaking, sailing, swimming, or enjoying just a day on the lake. The big difference between a Type 2 and a Type 3 life jacket is that a Type 3 will not flip you over because it doesn't have the head support that the Type 2 does. So a Type 4 throwable life jacket is actually not a life jacket at all. These PFDs are throwable, which means that they're meant to be thrown overboard during a rescue situation. A life ring or cushion are two types of Type 4 PFDs used on a boat. Having a Type 4 available on a boat is actually required by law. So next time that you're on a boat, make sure you have one of these easily accessible. The Type 5 PFT is becoming a lot more popular. This life jacket is very compact and it keeps you cool on sunny days. It's becoming very popular for activities such as fishing, kayaking, boating, things like that. This life jacket is different from a traditional life jacket in that it is inflatable. There's a CO2 cartridge inside that inflates the life jacket as soon as a person hits the water. Or whenever a person pulls this yellow tab right here like this. Since this life jacket is a little more complicated, it requires a little bit more maintenance. That CO2 cartridge, you need to check it every so often to make sure it's not expired. And once it expires, you have to replace it. You also have to replace the CO2 cartridge whenever you activate the life jacket. So this one's in need of recharging. If you feel like this maintenance is too much, just go with the traditional life jacket. Once you pick your life jacket, don't forget to inspect it by checking for rips, faded fabric, or broken buckles. Make sure it's the correct size and that it's Coast Guard approved. No matter what activity you have planned at the lake, picking one of these five PFDs can save your life. Which one will you pick for your trip to the lake?